Greetings, citizens of Nerdtropolis. Sean Todge here, the mayor of Nerdtropolis, and on this episode of Real Insights, my guests are the voice cast of Tales of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Hello, fellas. Hey, how's it going? Oh, what's up, Sean? It is great to meet you all. And Micah, it's great to see you again. It's been a while, but we got to talk previously. It was yes. a good time. Thank you. Yeah, great to see you. Uh, just a heads up for all of you, if you did not get the word yet, that Mutant Mayhem was the Nerdtropolis animated movie of the year. So just in case that news that make it to you, I'll just heads up on yes, that. Yes, hey, hey, yeah, yeah, thank, thank you so you. much. <laughs> As a OG TMT fan that I am, I was blown away by the film and super excited when I heard this series was coming out. Uh, absolutely love Tales of the TMT and the unique storytelling it offered. And I was glued to my couch watching every episode. Uh, I had a bowl of cereal in my lap watching, so it transported me to my childhood. Uh, so Saturday, Saturday mornings, morning, yeah. yeah, exactly. Saturday morning cartoons was a big deal for me. So I want to know y'all's favorite cartoon growing up. And, you know, what's your favorite cereal? And we can start with uh, Micah. Um, without a doubt, Phineas and Ferb has my heart for forever. Um, I met Dr. Doofenshmirtz, and he was a great guy, so I have to give him... Probably would have to go with Captain Crunch or Cocoa Puffs. Um, yeah, those. That's just my. That's just me in in a in a nutshell. Hmm. I guess we're going down the line. Uh, I'm in between like regular show and Adventure Time. I can't really like pick one. But uh, as for cereal, I'm probably gonna have to go Frosted Mini Wheats, the blueberry ones. Ooh. Isn't that weird? Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> Mine would have to be um, Avatar: The Last Airbender. Okay. OG show that was probably my favorite show growing up, and uh, I would say Frosted Flakes or or not Frosted Flakes, uh, Fruit Loops or Apple Jacks. Mm. Ooh, yeah. Nice. I'd say I loved a lot of like um, Amazing World of Gumball. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Thanks, Shimon. Thank you, bro. <laughs> um, Adventure Time. I'm super into Steven Universe and stuff too. Um, favorite cereal, I'd probably say Frosted Flakes or like Captain Crunch Berries. Facts. Mm. Sean, what's your go-to? I, I love like, you know, Fruity Pebbles and I just yes. like also Frost Flakes. And sometimes, you know, you get those variety packs and I just dump it all in one bowl. Yeah. Oh, dude, that's, right. oh, that's a good choice. That's nice. a good choice. <laughs> just the luck of the draw, right? Whatever those variety packs they <laughs> yeah. give you. So I definitely love that. Really enjoyed this. You know, obviously the Ninja Turtles live in New York City. Uh, have all of y'all been to New York City? I, I'm sure y'all have, right? Uh, yeah, yeah. Have. Oh, sure. yeah. So I need to know your favorite spot in NYC to visit, maybe a favorite landmark or place. And we'll start over back to line with Micah. No, don't do this to me. Um, <laughs> I was there like a couple weeks ago, and I went to a place called Rosa's, I think. It's an Italian restaurant, very, very good. Or Halal, guys. I know that's a big thing. Um, very good. Yeah, I mean, it's just... Uh, Crazy, crazy place, but there's so many cool finds that you can find there. I'm sure there's like a million answers for this. I like the M&M store in Times Square. No, I, I don't know what that is. <laughs> I don't think I've ever been to the M&M store in Times Square. Um, there's like a there's a restaurant in the East Village. I, I'm, I hope I'm not butchering the name. It's like Vaselka or something like that. That was a pretty good spot. Hmm. I would say uh, it wouldn't be in the city. It would just be in New York, but like Ithaca, New York is really, really sick. Uh, it's got like um, like a lot of sp spots for like cliff jumping like into water, which is like pretty sick. Wow. But like, yeah, like there's like everyone just thinks New York, you know, like they think like giant city, but there's like there's actual like land Tapped there too. In. Like yeah, like in the New York, uh, like in the upstate. Hmm. Times Square in general, just Times Square in general, like it's just so much to look at and it's so different from where I'm from, Chicago. So it's like to see another major big city like Times Square, probably like. Anywhere like the plays like Broadway, stuff like that. Pretty cool. I love that. I, I'm going to recommend The Edge over there. That's actually where I proposed to my fiance uh, oh, last year. So check out The Edge. Congratulations. Thank yeah. you so much. You guys see the whole city from there, but check it out. Oh, I've heard um, about this. Yeah, yeah, I know what you're talking about. It's really cool. But I got a last question. We got to go quickly on this one. But favorite pizza toppings? I know my God, I think I know yours, but we'll start all over again. Pepperoni, bacon, and then sometimes we'll switch it up and add some pineapple. Okay. Love it. I'm going to go pepperoni and mushroom. I'm going to go hot honey pepperoni. That's a good, good mm. answer. Sausage and apple with smoked bacon. Ooh. Oh, I got to try them all. For me, it's like pepperoni, some ricotta, some black olives, and maybe some, uh, I don't Sounds know, great. add anything in there. Some truffle, you know, some truffle yeah. in there, too. Some great oh, yeah. stuff. Love it. Love it. Yeah. 
Guys, it was great catching up with y'all, and I'm definitely going to have to do this again when the next feature film comes out, but this was a blast. Thank you, Sean. Awesome, man. Good it to see you. a great time. Good seeing you. Once again, this is Sean Taj, the mayor of Nertropolis, and stay tuned for more movie news, reviews, interviews, and trailers.